I am Besarta and this is a grammar lesson about two situations. The first situation is when we talk about actions that are happening at the moment of speaking and the second situation is when we talk about things that are true in general. So let's get started. Let's have a look at these two situations. The first situation is this. My sister is in her car. She's on her way to work. She's driving to work. This means that she's driving now, at the time of speaking. The action is not finished yet. The second situation. My brother is a bus driver, but he is in bed asleep. He is not driving a bus. He is asleep, but he drives a bus. He is a bus driver. In this case, we are not talking about something that is happening at the moment of speaking, but it is a fact that he is a bus driver because he drives a bus. The difference between these two sentences. The first sentence, she is driving to work, and the second sentence, he drives a bus. In the first sentence, she is the subject, is is the verb be, Drive is the main verb with ing. In the second sentence, he is the subject, drive is the main verb plus s. From the structure of these two sentences, we can say that the first sentence is in present continuous and the second sentence is in present simple. Affirmative form present continuous. In present continuous affirmative form, first we use the subject, then the verb be, and then the main verb with ing. I am working, you are working, he is working, she is working, it is working, we are working, you are working, they are working. Present simple affirmative form. I work, you work, he works, she works, it works, we work, you work, they work. Negative form, present continuous and present simple. Present continuous negative form. First we use the subject, then the verb be, then not, and then the main verb with ing. I am not working. You are not working. He is not working. She is not working. It is not working. We are not working, you are not working, they are not working. Present simple negative form. In present simple negative form we use not, but this time after the verb do. I do not work, you do not work. He does not work, she does not work. It does not work, we do not work, you do not work, they do not work. Questions. Present continuous, present simple. In present continuous question form, first we use the verb be, then the subject, and then the main verb with ing. Am I working? Are you working? Is he working? Is she working? Is it working? Are we working? Are you working? Are they working? Present simple. Do I work? Do you work? Does he work? Does she work? Does it work? Do we work? Do you work? Do they work? Note how we make questions. Present continuous, affirmative form. I am cooking dinner. Question form. Am I cooking dinner? So, in the affirmative form, we use first the subject, then the verb be, and then the main verb with ing. In question, first we use the verb be, and then the subject, and then the main verb with ing. Another example. Jack is playing football now. Is Jack playing football now? In the affirmative form, we have used the subject, the verb be, then the main verb with ing. Question form. First, verb be, then the subject, and then the main verb with ing. Present simple. 
I cook dinner? Affirmative form. Do I cook dinner? Question form. So in the question form we use do. Jack plays football every week. Affirmative form. Does Jack play football every week? Question form. In this case we have used does instead of do because Jack is third person singular. Present simple third person singular. When we use present simple, we should pay an extra attention in the third person singular because in the third person singular, he, she, it, we add s to the verb. He eats. Another example. I never cook dinner and he always cooks dinner. But if a verb ends in ss, sh, C, H, or O, we add E, S. For example, I watch, she watches. I wash, she washes. I guess, he guesses. I go, he goes. If a verb ends in a consonant, for example, B, C, D, F, etc., plus Y, we change Y to I, E, S. For example, I study, she studies. Present continuous. When do we use present continuous? We use present continuous to talk about actions that are in progress now, in the present. For example, I am speaking now, but the action is not necessarily happening at the time of speaking. For example, I am reading a good book at the moment. So, it is not necessary that I am reading the book at the moment, but I have started to read the book and I haven't finished it yet. Present continuous is used also to talk about arrangements for the future. For example, they are coming to the party next Sunday. Present simple. When do we use present simple? We use present simple to talk about habits, regular activities and things that are generally true. For example, I play football every week. Elephants don't eat meat. The earth goes around the sun. Do present continuous. Do can function as a main verb in present continuous. For example, I am doing something. I am in the middle of doing it. I have started doing it, but I haven't finished yet. Do present simple. Do, don't, does and doesn't are part of present simple, but do is also an ordinary verb. For example, he does his homework every week and what do you do at the weekend? In these two examples, do is the main verb. This is all about this lesson. Thank you. Have a nice day. Goodbye.